regards to godly conversations with Amanda and myself, we have such an amazing package for you. You will you will love this. I promise, I promise, I promise you will love this. So keep keep watching, subscribe, tell your friends to watch us and like our Facebook page as well. Thank you. There's got to be someone uh, because uh, between the husband and the wife who yeah. is able to bring that structure in the home, yeah. who will be able to say, this two days, we yeah. will be hands-on on doing this. Yeah. Every other day, yes, it's been delegated, but you're still checking in. You still have that time with your kids. Yeah. You know, I mean, it's boys, so they'll, they'll be a <laughs> scar. Yeah, they'll be <laughs> I'm like, what happened here? What, what happened? And just know, okay, in school, this yeah. is... And if there are school meetings, I, I make uh, the school meetings. Yeah. I make time for the school meetings, make time for their school plays. Yeah. My husband is not able to make time for all mm -hmm. those things. Mm -hmm. But between the two of us, one of us is constantly present, mm -hmm. is there, is mm -hmm. able to see them before they go to bed, yeah. you know, to mm -hmm. be there, to mm -hmm. see how was their day. Yeah. So there is a way you can structure your household yes. to be present in your kids' life. doesn't mm. mean you let go of your work mm -hmm. and decide you have to be a stay-at-home yeah. mom. If that doesn't work for your yeah. household, you don't have to be a stay-at-home yeah. mom. But it, it can well and good, especially yes. if you have little ones who are not yet able to verbalize what's going on in their yes, lives. Yeah. That's why I waited until my little one can at least, you know, Noah can at least say, <laughs> Gonga! Yes. Ah, you know, as in, yes, and I can know something happened to yeah. him. But before they're able to vocalize, I made sure I was there, I yeah. was present. Yeah. So if that can't work in your household, you can structure a mm -hmm. way that you can you can be present, you yeah. can be aware, yeah. you can, you can follow up with them so that you're not also strangers to them yes. because it can be yeah. too late at yes. a certain age yes. to try and form a relationship yes. with them so and i do have busy friends as well who mm. still say they do tuck-ins mm. you know they come mm. and tuck them mm. in bed they do you know shower time where they say mm. you know at least wednesday friday i'm the one who give them a bath yeah. and mm. we'll get and pray with them before yeah. they go to bed so i have friends also who have busy schedules mm. but have learned how to structure yeah something in their household that works for their works, children yeah. yeah because i think when they're little we owe it to them to be present it's we true. owe it to them because to they grow up there. so fast yes like mm -hmm. blinking and yes i mean i remember <laughs> my labor with nolan and he's <laughs> that's like and 10 years i know <laughs> i don't think but i remember it's yeah. come that fast yeah but i remember my yes. first pregnancy yeah. so it the years go by really fast yeah. just just make make a point of being there be yeah to not to be you know their bffs yeah. but to be there to be have a relationship mm -hmm. with them that they, they they're able to come to you mm -hmm. even when they're adults or yeah. preteens yes. or teens yeah with with a question yeah with with something that has crept in and they're like how do i go yeah. about this they can be able to because i believe the best answers that are not laced with um, ulterior mm, motive mm. will come from your parents. Your parents, yeah. yeah. So they want the best for you. Yes. I, I was watching a short clip today this morning, and it was this dad and son. It was like a cartoon, uh -huh. and the, the small boy kept, you know, dad. Like he was playing soccer and did something, dad. And the dad was like, not now, son. Not now, son. He kept saying that every time. So this guy, this little boy, grew up, and now he's a teenager. He's going to school with the earphones, and the dad is like, son like not now dad you know wow. so it just the cycle it, it, change, it changes you know and right now i think the stage where our parents are the in a place where most of them are depending kind of on us yeah. like we you know we are supposed to be there for them <music> us today hope this segment helped you if you have any questions send us an email write to us and don't forget to ask your friends to subscribe to our page keep liking keep sending comments and we'll try our best to answer most of the questions that you have god bless you